Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Vessie. I hope you are all staying fabulous. So without further ado, I'm gonna just dive right into this video. Okay. Alright, so guys, welcome back. If you are new on this channel, you are very much welcome. Be sure to subscribe and leave a comment in this comment section below, okay? Thank you. And if you are returning, one love, one love. Please share this video so that our family members can increase. You understand? We need them to increase in, in large form. Very, very large. You understand? Alright, guys. So, to the point of today, I'm going to be talking about some certain assumptions about friendship. Pardon me if I'm going to be talking a bit fast, but I will try and slow down and relax, okay? So, I'll be talking about certain assumptions about friendship. Mm, mm, mm. Number one point will be if you don't have friends no number one point is what will be oh yeah. all right so the number one point i'm gonna be talking about is the assumption saying that if you don't have friends something is wrong with you where where is that coming from nothing is wrong with you it's just a case of mutual support what is friendship before i go dive into that explanation what is friendship? I mean, there is a general explanation about friendship, okay? The general explanation about friendship, the general definition that I saw on the dictionary, on the internet, is that friendship is a state of mutual trust, support, affection towards people, between two people, between one another. We can go on and on. Understand? But basically, it is a state of mutual. What is mutual? Something consensual. We are agreeing to it. We agree to it. It's, it's equal. 50-50. Do you understand? That's, that's trusted. And what do I understand by friendship? In fact, my, it's just, they basically explain that friendship to me is support someone that understands you okay someone that is that is that that you are comfortable around a comfort zone for you not because i want to project imperfections or something to that person but please that when i talk when you correct me i don't take offense when i correct you you don't take offense when i mean a lot of things okay a lot of things so i would like to know in the comment section below what you guys think friendship is i can go on and on because there are different levels of explanation about friendship but you guys are the you know you know my real mvps so you're gonna comment below and let me know what you guys think about friendship okay so um like i said about the points if you don't have friends friends something is wrong with you nothing is wrong with you what i feel what i understand is that basically it's not a mutual thing okay the person does not have mutual feelings just as you do it might be uh, I mean, I'm not talking about just relationship here between a guy and a lady, but also between friends, females. It's not mutual. I mean, first of all, why are you in that friendship? Is it because of social class, people that are wealthy, status and everything? You know, people in your clique, the kind of clique you move about with, okay? Is it because, are you in that friendship because of that? Or you're in a friendship because you feel you and the person vibe, you know, you guys do stuff and you feel, oh yeah, this person gets me. The person is on my reading. We we vibe well and everything. Why are you in that friendship? Is that just the reason? Because if those are just the reasons, then somehow that friendship is going to crash. It's just the honest truth. Somehow, as we grow, as things change, we all want that one friend that's going to support us. We want that one friend that's going to serve as a push because believe it or not, sometimes you feel so reluctant. Sometimes you feel so down to do some certain things and you need a certain push from someone sincere, someone that knows where you're going to, someone that knows your focus, someone that can remind you, hey, you're going somewhere. Do you know where your destination is? So get your lazy self out of the bed and move. All right? We all need that one person. And if it's not mutual, if it's not, you know, trustworthy, if it's not supportive, I don't think it's what it's worth having. So if you don't have such friends and you don't have a friend now or 
you were you you are that kind of person but be, people that come around you are not such kind of people then nothing is wrong with you it's okay not to have friends i mean it's better not to have friends that are better not to have friends that are toxic okay next one i'm gonna be talking about is the more friends you have the better reaction sorry guys i'm gonna be looking down on the book because i wrote down the points and they are not on my head so i have to look down once in a while okay so <laughs> the, another assumption is the more friends you have the more reaction you don't need friends to 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 have some certain reactions oh okay like the party mode or the beauty mode the big girl mode the i don't know the what's up guy and flicky flicky all those things you don't need anyone you don't need a friend to make you have that reaction you don't need more friends to make you have that reaction as far as i'm concerned the more friends you have the more you need to project the more um the more expectations are being thrown at you the more things like the more you just have to do a lot of things sometimes you even have to pretend because you're trying to please this one trying to please that one trying to and if you keep going like that <laughs> you're gonna die yes i have to be realistic about this you're literally gonna be drained it's gonna drain you you feel so so drain and nothing is gonna be exciting anymore to you so don't place yourself in such an assumption class please okay we shouldn't try to do that i'm also in the process i'm not saying this because i'm perfect so if you want to know why i'm making this video please keep watching all right and we're gonna get to the end of this in a short short while so because i'm gonna be using we and not just you all right we don't need more friends to validate our reactions do not place yourself in that here is something guys we all need one thing or the other from someone from something from life if you're in a relationship with a guy eventually if you love this person you want the relationship maybe end in marriage if that person is your ideal man if you are in a relationship with any relationship with someone friendship we all need something we all want something out of that friendship either to support us either for our mental health either for something one thing or the other but be very careful not to project a lot of expectation to such people because i'm going to disappoint you but just try as much as possible to create all the zones all of this thing in your own circle personally before you accommodate others so that when they disappoint you so that when those things don't actualize you're gonna be cool all right you're gonna be fine you just be good be good all right so you don't need more friends for reaction the reaction is within you is you is who you are you react according to your personality you don't need anyone to make you fake it okay you don't need to fake it if that's not you do not fake it you're gonna get tired okay thank you so guys i am so sorry i have to cut this video here and i'm gonna post the next part very soon so just be sure to click on the notification bell so you can get notified on when i post the last part of this you know you know what i mean okay thanks for watching so far and don't forget to subscribe love you guys and see you soon